running down the, the white lines really he's that far wide but it's a clever ball for Adebayo and he to pokes it in too good save by the goalkeeper Clark with his first chance blocked and his second one blocked as well Long it goes for oh, Adebayo this time who's through this time and it's a really poor finish from Elijah Adebayo Here's Clark again playing a little ball around the corner and it's Oni Dinmar this time who pulls it back and it's somehow wide and I'm what not quite chance. sure how, what a great chance that was. Greg Cunningham has a time to look up and send it forward into the penalty area this time. And now Brian's header ricochets into the arms of the goalkeeper and rolls it quickly forward as a uh, heavy challenge there from uh, Whiteman is penalised by the referee. Both teams are uh, having plenty to say uh, about that challenge. It's uh, Pali Roddick in Panzu who is on the ground, and there's a big call here for the uh, referee. It is a red card. He's sent off. The North End midfielder given his marching orders. Ball just bouncing around and it falls to Jordan Clark, what who looks ball. for Adebayo this time, who uh, tries to bend it into the corner. Here's uh, Fernandez now trying to burst forward. It's lovely from him, and uh, this could be the chance now for Parrott, and it's side netting. Luton are packing the six-yard box in front of the goalkeeper and it's uh, Puss in front of him, comes back off the crossbar, drops the safety and uh, Fernandez is able to get it away. Jordan Clark, who else is making the run now, he's just inside the penalty area and he pulls it back as well to the near post and uh, it was Morris waiting there but North End were able to defend it and get it clear for the time being at least. It's uh, Amari Bell on the left-hand side who's uh, crossing deep towards the far post and this time Luton I think have scored and uh, Carlton Morris is celebrating the referee checks the goal line system it indicates it went over and uh, finally Luton have got the goal that had been coming in this game Andrew Hughes tries to pick one of his teammates out in the box he does do that now appeals for handball and the referee points to the spot it's a penalty kick for the block by the defender. It is Parrots ready with the spot kick and a chance to equalise. He steps up and scores. Brilliant finish from Troy Parrott, who gets his first goal since injury, his third of the season, and it's a huge sigh of relief here at Deepdale. The ten men of North End are level. to show you just stay in the game for as long as you can and you anything can happen and here could be another chance it's Cannon this time Cannon just wide what a moment that could have been comes out wide this time and Luton fizz a ball into the penalty area and it's a dangerous header could drop here for Berry. blocked again by the defence um, it was excellent work from North End in the closing stages of the game.